Oh, hello, good morning, good morning. Here's the crew. EB, hi. You ready for a dance party? You ready for a dance party? Cutest thing ever. Girls, ready for school? Donuts, we got braids, we got donuts. Whoa, don't take a girl's donut. Did you teach her that defensive move? Donuts. Uh oh. Aloha. Aloha. You remember that from Hawaii? Yeah. Mukalaki hiki. You want to go back to Hawaii one day? Yeah. Yeah. And buy the motors. Buy some more shirts? Yeah. More Hawaii shirts. All right. He's only got one, so he needs more. <laughs> Alright guys, project time. Got to recover from this. Putting these, uh, I don't even know what they're called, back on the door. Alright, back in business. We'll deal with the uh, caulking and whatnot later, but yeah, we're back on. Alright guys, day two of Ragnar training for April. How did it go? Your face looks red. <laughs> I like running outside, but I don't like how out of shape I am. I did two and a half miles and it was really hard. First mile was easy, the second It's only mile. your second run. I wouldn't be too hard on yourself. You'll get back into it. Tell me exactly what's happening right now. And look up there and we're trying to find out what it is and whatever it is, um, Jake and and are all going to hide and they're going to make a little box that the thing can't no, get I'm out of there. And then, um, I mean, I did I pop it in the cup, grab one of these, slowly put it back on, and then I don't know. Really okay, and what do we think it is? Do we have any ideas? I think it's a, it's Wait, let's have Ender talk. Let's have Ender talk. Think you think it's, it's a, a monster? Rat. You think it's a rat? Show me the bite. Okay, okay so it's either a monster Please. or a rat. Yeah. Okay, good luck. Tell me if you catch anything, okay? Mm -hmm. Ender, are you afraid? No. Wait, didn't you see what bit you? They said it was a really tiny thing that could turn invisible. But Ender, did you not, you didn't see it because it was invisible? Mm -hmm. I saw it. It was it. like a thing that is black that turns invisible. So, you, what did you find downstairs? Did you find a rat? Or a monster? A rat. A rat? Yeah, by my big sister. By your big sister? Yeah. And what did you guys do? We got him. Oh, you got him? But it was a wrapper. Oh, it's just a wrapper? Yeah. Okay. So not that being a wrapper. So what bit you? Was it the wrapper? No. It was a monster downstairs. No, it was a bat. A bat? No. Or a rat? Rat. A rat. Oh. Ender, guess what? Ender, I have a surprise for you. Bye. I got you a proper baseball. Oh. And a proper glove. What do you think? Thank you, Dad. Do you want to play catch? Let's do this outside. It's pretty soft. Bye. Anyone want to play outside? It's nice outside. All right. I'm gonna try to be better about making dinner. It's, I've fallen off the making dinner bandwagon. I wanna jump back on. I wanna be more healthy. And so I'm making tacos, chicken tacos tonight, chopping up some tomatoes. And I, the kids love cucumbers just with vinegar and salt and pepper and that's super good. Like the vinegar I think is really good for them and the cucumber too, so. Maybe not the salt and pepper, but if that's what gets them to eat it, then awesome, they'll eat a whole bowl full. So I'm gonna chop up that, and then we have the rest of the night after dinner to chill. <laughs> like Wednesdays are kind of crazy because we have three different piano lessons at different times of the day and like three different, just lots of different schedules going on. And so it's a good day to cook at home. You'd think that'd be a good day to go out, but I'm sick of leaving the house. <laughs> like where you need to eat in on Wednesdays, so. I was just watching E.B. run over to the carriage. She's so in love with riding around in that thing. She finds someone to ride her around and it's so cute. That girl has two speeds. It's asleep or going fast. <laughs> There's no in-between speeds. 
Got the chicken chopped up. I just used this McCormick chicken taco packet. The kids like it. It's easy. And then just do some cheese. And I think we have some limes. Mm, that would be good. I think we have cabbage too. It's getting old. What are you gonna tell daddy? What did you ask me? What do you wanna do? You want to play baseball with daddy? He asked me. I said yes after dinner and he got mad and left. I want to play baseball with you after dinner, okay? Yeah, yeah. I had to say no to that. I know. I, I had to say no. <laughs> Looking good. All right. Walmart is on the fidget spinner bandwagon. Check them out. We'll see it, Daisy. Faster! Faster, faster, faster! Those are cool, huh? Oh, Daisy! Oh, Daisy! <laughs> and AB is addicted to Cadbury eggs. I don't know if it's that they make these Cadbury eggs only around Easter time, or if that they're, they just put crack or some kind of heroin or addictive substance in them, but I can't stop. You want some? With that said, why am I giving them to my children? <laughs> You're asking for more of these? Yeah. Why do you want more? It tastes like chocolate and I like chocolate. They don't just taste like chocolate. What else is in them? Did you know they put drugs in them? Really? Yeah, that's what, why do you think you want more? They really put drugs in them. I think so. I swear they're addictive. You're gonna eat them still? Uh-huh. You know, there's no physical proof that they actually do put drugs in them. I'm pretty sure they don't, but it seems like they do have them because they're so addictive. Get out of here. Yeah, she's addicted. She's a thief. Go get her. She doesn't even know it's coming. Share, Ambry. Good girl. Spring can officially come. The Christmas lights are down. Oh, wow. Yeah. A little late this year, but... Made it up. You proud of me, Evie? April? I'm proud of you, babe. Good job. It kind of hurt, it wa hurt walking on a slant with my toe, but I survived the roof. I survived cleaning up there. Good job. drop your bear oh he dropped it okay what she was doing was dipping the bear in the water and then sucking the water off of it and I caught you doing something so weird she was dipping her bear in the water to get a drink because she couldn't reach it for herself that was so gross sometimes people make me frustrated you remember when we stayed in Oregon on the beach house and we were like looking everywhere the whole week for a vacuum and a broom and a dustpan? You guys thought I was complaining. Uh, like, we weren't like, really oh, complaining. This is where a va va vacuum should be, but I was just like, we really want to clean this house up. <laughs> we really want to clean it. Almost ruined the trip how gross the house was because we had like lots of little kids in there and it was crummy everywhere and we kept wanting to vacuum and I had the kids several times on their hands and he's picking up little pieces. Anyway. Yes, I'll play baseball I'll with you. Okay. Wait, let me get anyway, it. we were really nice in the review and didn't mention that and we even texted the landlord and was like Where's the vacuum in the broom and dustpan? We are sick of living on the crummy floor and she was just like it should be either in the pantry or in the garage We searched everywhere in the house. We could not find any of it. Anyway now She's requesting a $200 cleaning fee because it was so many crumbs everywhere. I'm like lady seriously so anyway, yeah, don't stay in this Airbnb. Bad landlord. Because we even asked her where it was and she gave us a, I don't know, either in this place or this place and it wasn't there and now she's like mad at us because we didn't vacuum and sweep up after ourselves. Which wasn't even in the instructions on what to do when you leave the house. So, ugh, frustrating. I just don't like getting accused of stuff that we don't do. Like We cleaned it as best we could. 
is frustrating. Another thing she said in the review was we would not, or what did she say? We don't want to have you. That, was, that was in her private message. Her review was. The nice. review was all the review said was they were quiet and kept to themselves. That's like. But yeah, okay. she messaged and said we don't want you back. We don't want you back. I was like, well, we don't want to come back. Okay, come on. Get it, Ender. Oh wow, wait. Actually, maybe we should do this We're downstairs. Good. This is soft. This is soft. <laughs> but a soft thing hitting a glass bulb will still break. Come on, come on. Under her. Yeah. Oh, come on, come on. Come on, come on. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on. Come on, come on. Come on. How old are you? Oh, How old are you, Ender? No, just stand there, stand there. Come on. There we go. Come on. Oh, come on. How old are you, Ender? Four. Four. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. All right, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, okay, just do the regular thing. Oh, back in the <laughs> Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. You're getting way good. Oh, come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, jump throw. Jump throw. Come on. Get it ready. Get it ready. Come on. Oh. <laughs> and then everything's okay again because of sweet Ender. We're not even mad anymore. You are so cute, Ender. <laughs> April in real life. It's real. No. Oh, it's getting real now. <laughs> Bunko group is funny on text, and I had to get caught up. There was like 20 unread messages, and they all made me laugh. Good. Glad you have some joy in your life. <laughs> um, you guys, thanks for watching the vlog today. Uh, no, it's funny because I misread Anna. To and Anna, because I'm dyslexic and I totally made a fool of myself. <laughs> it's really funny. Had to be there. Um, you guys, quick fun fact. Uh, we bought that Iron Man suit. I showed you only the mask. And last night, post vlog, oh me and gosh, April, so we spent about 90 minutes trying to put it no, together. It was, it was two hours. Two hours. <laughs> it was way harder than. I peed my pants laughing. <laughs> I had to run away. I was like halfway trapped in the suit and couldn't move. And <laughs> his head was against the wall. Hold on. This is bad to be there too, but he's in this suit and can't move. I have to pee so bad. The mask keeps falling off the back. Back part's falling off. I had to like, has cords hooked everywhere. It's a mess, guys. So he can't reach his hands because he can't bend his elbows past this. And the mask keeps falling off. So I had to have him walk over to the wall and lean his head on the wall while I went to the bathroom. And I just started. And it's got like this voice modulator. And I'm like, April, oh, help me. Help me. The funniest thing ever. It was oh, yeah. funny. And I forgot about the voice modulator, so every time he talked to me, I just like laughed harder and I was just peeing my pants. It was so horrible. <laughs> so we need some practice. We're planning on introducing this at CVX Live and maybe making exactly. some videos before then. But um, yes, we need a little more practice putting this suit on. It's a little harder than Tony Stark putting, saying Jarvis, Jarvis, or just like snapping and then it just snaps to him. Like, I want that suit, the pocket one. When is that one going to be for sale? That's what I'm looking for. So that's it. Okay, guys, it's over. Thanks for watching. See you tomorrow.